Alright, so you can see the extruder heads climbing up pretty quick. That heats up pretty fast. And the Mendel Max 3, it's got these cool LEDs that have a status symbol based on uh, your bed heater and your head heater and all that kind of stuff. We're just printing a 10 millimeter cube. I don't expect very much. I don't expect to even stick right. I don't know if I got my squish right on my first layer or anything. If we actually print something, I would be surprised. But the heater kicks on for the V6 head at 60 C. So when you that extruder head gets to 60 C back in here, the fan kicks on. And then when it gets up to the target temperature, which is 232, the machine will take off and start running. Now I never purged the extruder or anything. This is all a brand new system. And uh, we're just doing a little first time run video. And I'm sure it's not going to work. It's going to be terrible. But uh, we'll see what happens. Okay, it's about ready to start printing. Let's see, we're at 229, 31, 3250. So it should take off here in just a second. There it goes. If it purges that heater head, we haven't had any filament through that extruder yet. There we go. It just took a little bit of a loop. Looks like it's sticking. This is ABS. We get these different colors and stuff as it's printing. And uh, let's zoom in there. Again, I have never done anything to this except load the head with some... Uh, some filament and we'll see what happens boy it's a smooth action on the Mendel Max 3 now, I did convert my Mendel Max 2 to Mendel Max 3 because this cube is even remotely square I'll be surprised I see the corners are a little tall, so it's probably going to be a uh, kind of weird shaped in the corners. Won't be exactly a cube, but it'll look more like a, I don't know, high corners, <laughs> dip, dip sides and high corners. But boy, it sure is quiet. Like I said, this is the first time I've ever printed with this, the Mendel Max 3. Extruder's working kick ass. Tables lined up good. I mean, just everything about this thing is just so sweet. People say ABS is really hard to print. Well, I can't print PLA, I can print ABS. <laughs> you see, there's no fans on here. And the uh, larger the piece of ABS you get, the harder it is. But uh, so far, this is looking pretty sweet. I'm pretty impressed. You can see there's usually two outside rings. But uh, like I said, I didn't even purge the uh, the head. I just fed the filament into the top there and started the print. And it went around one and a quarter times and then it finally purged. So, man, that's pretty good, I think. And these little cubes are really hard to print because they'll be real oblong and weird looking. I just want to see how my layers stick. And... Uh, see generally how it looks I'm just excited that it's even printing again but it's been a couple weeks or so since I started this project there it's filling in the top right now my makeshift uh, clamp system is working pretty good zip tie <laughs> And run it through that tube and down to a direct feed into the extruder and there's the cube 
Looks pretty darn good, guys. That's exciting. Mendel Max 3. Yeah, see, man, it gives you like this uh, back and forth Knight Rider thing when you finished your print. Wow, this is a really cool printer, guys. There it is as a whole. What a neat deal. Alright, that's the uh, maiden print on the Mendel Max 3.